Around 800 people gather near Caixa Geral de Depósitos Bank headquarters to protest against cuts in social benefits. In the meanwhile, Trade Union Federation CGTP organized a march to protest against precarious jobs that young workers are being forced to accept. As public servants, Caixa Geral de Depósitos employees should lose vacation and Christmas bonus this year. Palmira Arial belongs to the Trade Union of Bank Workers, the SBSI. Government measures are attacking our bank. We are in the center of a project to destroy the entire Caixa Group. Workers of Caixa Geral de Depósitos Bank were not the only ones complaining. Ligia Horta, a former worker, does not accept the cuts. I think I've worked a lot, and I don't accept them to cut our Christmas and vacation bonuses. A lot of workers of Caixa Geral de Depósitos Bank say they could become precarious employees, like it is happening in several major Portuguese corporations. And they are not alone. CGTP Trade Union Federation says call centers, hospitals and supermarkets have become more precarious. They abuse a usually young working force with no better options to survive. People are treated like machines and not like humans. I wonder how is the future of my daughter going to be. I struggle to pay the rent, my car, all the insurances. I need to eat and take my daughter to school. Some of my friends have three jobs, and a lot of people here are on psychiatric leave. The march started near a shopping center in Lisbon, another symbol of precarious jobs for many Portuguese workers. Last stop, an employment agency where there were some tense moments between some of the marchers and police forces. Demonstrations and concentrations in Portugal tend to be peaceful, but now they're getting more frequent. In the private sector and in public companies, workers from all areas are now showing their discontempt towards the government and these austerity measures. Antonio Oliveira Silva, Press TV, Lisbon.